this has got to go. I can't do this anymore. Y'all, I think I just bleached my hair so much that now it's straight. But I wanted it really white for the stage this past weekend. And I got that. And now you know, my hair is not, does not have any kind of texturizer or anything in it. It only had the color, the BW2, the Clairol number 50. But now it's just... It's not falling out or anything. It's just nappy thick. It's just an afro and it's getting ready to get cut off today. I'm telling you, I'm getting ready to cut this mess off completely. Good morning, beautiful babes. <laughs> I am just tripping this morning. I'm so over this hair. Y'all know how I get. I don't like hair. I don't I don't like hair on my head. And it's getting to the point where I'm too through. I am seriously over it. Over it. You know what I'm saying? You ever feel like that? I can't. I just can't. Y'all know I was taking that care of health stuff and it really did thicken my hair and give it some length. But this ain't what I want. Mm -mm. It's too much work. And then when I get up in the morning, you know, if there's no products in it, it doesn't act right. And now it's gotten to the point now where it's still, I don't know, it's not working. It's not working for me. So, y'all want to go on a haircut journey with me today? Today? Let's do it. Well, as I said earlier, y'all know what time it is. It's time to get the little peanut out. This is the clippers that I'm using, the wall peanuts. And it has like, like four different attachments to it that I'm going to get this hair intact. Uh, no, I don't have any kind of texturizer in my hair. I know many people do ask, but when I put in my hair color, uh, well, bleach my hair with the BW2 and I use anywhere from 20 to 50 volume developer. Um, it just gives my hair a different texture. And then when I put in all of my products, when I um, use my curl activator moisturizer and I put in my curl definer, this is the gel I've been using, the Smooth and Shine. Uh, it is from a Schwarzkopf or something like that. Schwarzkopf, I think I showed this before, uh, with camellia oil and shea butter. When I use that, and I also have another one that I tried, which isn't my favorite. It may do good since I do. I'll be having a lot shorter hair. Uh, it's the Styling Custard by uh, the Schwarzkopf Smooth and Shine. Um, so it's the same with the Camellia oil and shea butter in it. So technically, no. I can't do this, y'all. Just, just saying. So if you want to see me whack off this hair, I guess I'll take it a little bit at a time and see where I want to be with it, but I've got to get off all of the, you know, I don't know. I guess I just bleached it too much and I'm going to keep my hair light. That's just what I do. So it's no problem to cut it off and I'm tired of it anyway. I was taking that care of health and it did give my hair a lot more length, but I'm not ready for it yet. I, th I keep saying I want to grow my hair out, but that's some work because at night I would actually have to uh, plait it or braid it up and I ain't about that life. I ain't, mm -mm, mm -mm. your girl can't be doing all that and she's not and she's not. So it's time to do this for sure, for sure, for sure. Mm -hmm. Starting All right, let me try. Another guard here.
Trying to get the sides a little bit lower. And now we'll taper the neck part and the back there with the itty bitty ones. So. All right, that's it for the hair cutting part. Now we're gonna do some coloring. Mm-hmm. And uh, who knows what this is gonna turn out to be. Gotta close that line because now it's time to get down to the nitty gritty of things. Absolutely, it is. So. It looks so weird. And I told y'all how I mixed my um, mixture up for my hair coloring. So I just have an empty container. This was a BW2 course you see that and let's get this started Vaseline can take it all around the edges of my hair like so don't take but a minute, girl. Neck area. Tip of my ears. Just like that. Mm-hmm. Depend on where it like this. So when I put my coloring on it, I'll bring it all forward. For the BW2 powder, we're going to use two cups. Since I don't have much hair, just one cup. And two. And for the developer, let's try two cups of it as well just to give you some kind of measurement as to what I'm using. I have an extra cup, by the way. Yeah, I have an extra one of these that I use for this because I rinse it out once I finish. The other one I just put back into the container. I say two and a half cups of the developer. And that is perfect. Yes, make me want to put on some big earrings when your hair is short like this. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And if you're trying to be really neat with it, you can use one of those brushes. I don't have one. I can't use it. Y'all, I just take this out of the comb and I use my hands. I know. I know, but it's a great way to keep your knuckles bright, that's for sure. The texture actually comes with this coloring because I swear once you put it in, it will definitely loosen those locks up, that's for sure. And yes, it does make my eyes water. And that was pretty much a perfect amount. So, I'll just put the 
so here I'm gonna work it kind of into my scalp just to get those roots put my lid back on top of it here and put it in the cabinet and we're done with that and it's just a matter of sitting here with this on here for who knows I say really I don't no more than 15 minutes on my hair. Some people have it over 30 minutes or so. Uh uh. No, I don't do that. And I don't even use a bag on mine. I don't put a bag on because it, I just don't. All right, let me get this off of my hands. and clean up the bathroom in the process. All right, it's been about 10, 15 minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and get the shower and get this rest out of my hair. And I'll be back to put all my products in my hair. And I just been using today, which I did earlier, but I'll just show you how I layer the products. So stick and stay, I'll be right back. I am back, beautiful babes. Great, great shower. Absolutely. I'm going to go ahead and moisturize my face with my a new Ultimate Day Cream from Avon. It has an SPF in it of, I believe, 20 or 25. I can't see. Um, but this is what I'm going to moisturize with at this moment. Y'all... And I did a scrub on the other channel. This is the rest of it that's left. I probably only have maybe one more time to use it. I did use a little bit of it last night uh, before I showered and I just used some more uh, on my thighs. It's great for uh, cellulite and uh, slothing off dead skin and it'll also moisturize your skin. It has coconut oil in it, so this is great. So I did use that. Woo, now let's get to this hair. First thing we're going to put on is some castor oil. This is the Art Naturals castor oil. I use a couple of products from Art Naturals, one being my setting spray. Uh, it is supposed to be all natural and good for your skin and most importantly, doesn't contain alcohol uh, in it. So I'm going to put this on and that'll help moisturize my scalp. Then we're gonna take our S curl Curl Activator Moisturizer. I really don't have any curls anymore because everything's been cut out. And I'll spray that in the palm of my hand. Rub it in like so. Since I don't have much hair now, I can just rub it into my hair. And the final thing that I'll be using is the Curl Defining Gel. This is more or less going to keep it laid down for me uh, since I don't have any curls to define. And so we'll put that on now. Just a dab in my hands and rub it in like so. Maybe just a little bit more for the back. Ah, as you can see, my hair is like laying straight. Again, that is the bleach that I put in my hair, which makes it do that. So I'm just going to take a brush and brush my hair into a little bit of a style here. Can't do much styling, of course. I'm just taking a cool face cloth and putting on my face to close those pores back. Mm -hmm. Oh, and that's it for the hair, y'all. 
but I am done with that part of it. I'm just going to go ahead and get dressed and uh, pick this day off. I have no hair, so girl got to put some makeup on so she won't be looking like boyish, okay? I really got to do that. And I'll be finished. Uh, who knows what else is, I don't know what the, <laughs> what this day is going to hold. But this is it for now. So let me go ahead and get dressed up in here. And I'll holler at y'all later. Beautiful babies, please, if you enjoyed the video, please like, comment, subscribe. And you know what to do. Share your girl with your world. And I'll see you on the next one, which is right there. Yeah. Right there. Check that one out.